Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Quasimorph for season three, I guess. Wow, already on number three. Um, here we are, brand new game. We now have uh, multiple save slots, which is something that uh, I'm really happy about. Um, let's uh, jump in here. Humanity is written in tears and blood. Liars, tyrants, idealists. They all tried to bring happiness on the edge of a sword. We waited for liberation from the shackles of fate and were ready to go through the last judgment for it. Not for the glorious death for the eternal kingdom, love, or the Lord, but for a way to step off the path of suffering. But when the apocalypse came, we shrugged our shoulders. JPEG, baby. Profiting from it as usual. The creatures lurking in the depths of space didn't seem scarier than our own world. Armed with the hope that the darkest hour comes before dawn, we try to survive until the first rays of the sun. All right, so good to know that the uh the guy floating in space with the full frontal bull shot is still there. Don't ever change. All right, Jane. Hello. Good morning, boss. Good morning. Uh, we've read all this before, so let's uh let's move on here. Do you want to continue training? Yes. <clears throat> all right, we're gonna do the training mission here just so we can get ourselves uh a little little bonus. In terms of weaponry. Alright. Civil resistance is here. Alright. Let's go. It's one of the few games where I find using the mouse is preferable to using the numpad. Purely because you have to use the mouse. Um, and I don't have a left-handed numpad. I wish I did, but I just don't. Okay. Look at this, everybody. We are wearing trousers. I know you guys always say, oh, rat, he doesn't wear trousers. Guess what? We're wearing trousers. Just kidding. All right. Uh, what do we have here? We got our splint, we got our bandage, antibiotics. Let's freaking go. Okay, nobody here. Okay, if you press T, you can call her. We know that. I'm going to try and remember to crouch when I open doors. Alright, so there's the elevator. These are locked. What are you trying to hide from me? Well, nothing. Totally not worth it. <laughs> That's fine. You know, you live and you learn. All right, here we go. We'll go to the med block. This is the med bay. When your health reaches zero, you will die, of course. If the pain threshold reaches its limit, you'll skip a turn. Cool. Press H to open the health menu. Thank you for breaking my leg, I appreciate it. Now, this is a fracture. We will use the splint. Beautiful stuff. And we have an infection. Incredible. One thing I've never done, actually, is uh, self-amputate. In real life or in game. But, um... It would be funny. Okay, our fracture has come back. That is... 
Very sad. And our factory has come back again. Ha! Huh. It seems like the yeah the health system is still really, <laughs> really, really frustrating in this game. Uh, we may die as a result of this purely because this is the tutorial. Aha! Never mind. We have an auto dock. Right, we're good. Somebody's coming through the door. If you want to stand on the corpse without inspecting it, use control and left mouse. So that is actually a new keybind for as far as I'm concerned. I actually didn't know that. That was one of my biggest pet peeves from before. So really happy about that. Let's take all of this stuff here. Including the weapon. <clears throat> and let's re-equip with some decent armor. All right, lovely stuff. Don't forget to take the water. Don't forget to take the morphine. God, the morphine is so, so, so good. Okay, got no room for that. Um, We can certainly drop most of this stuff here. There we go. Right, let's swap over to this. Let's go to single fire mode for now. Okay, so this is the rocket they came in on. Bunch of disgusting clones. Boom. Delicious water. All right. Well, down we go to the armory. If I recall, last time we played a tutorial, um, we actually died. I think we got blown up by our own landmine. Let's try not to make that happen again. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. They just said if the ammo is in your tactical slot, it you can reload faster? Huh. That's really interesting. Yeah, that only took three turns instead of four. Right, get behind cover, it says. Okay, telling us to shoot the fuel barrel. My pleasure. Nice miss. Trying to conserve as much ammo as possible, but I think one more shot should do it here. Okay, great. Telling us about the fire modes there with F. Alright. Hey, we got a flash energy gun. Whether or not we'll be able to extract with it, I'm not sure yet. A gallon. Let's unload that. Uh, I think this is worse than this pistol. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's grab all the ammo here. And, of course, the better backpack, which is actually an incredible get for us. 
If I can extract with another uh, red outcast assault rifle, I would love that. Just put all of our ammo down there for now. Just for the sake of our future runs, I do want to grab as many of these. I may get rid of the flash gun. Nobody there. Nothing in here. Okay. Let's keep moving. Down to the engine room. Okay. I'm telling us about grenades. Uh, I'm still yet to really use one of these stationary turrets. It might not be a bad idea to use it. The problem is it just uses such valuable ammo, you know? Um, however, if we can extract with it, we could possibly trade it in if we get lucky. And let's grab these grenades. Do they stack? I think they stack in groups of two, if I remember. No, they... St okay, even better. All right, let's put the grenades on our hotbar. Uh, what is going on with our... Oh, we're just a little low on health is all. Okay. Coal nodes have barricaded themselves in the upper compartment. Get ready for a serious battle. We have several stationary turrets and mines. Okay. Um... So I think we have a, an opportunity here to put some mines down. Let's see if I can prevent uh, killing myself this time accidentally. Let's drop the antidote. Can I grab both of these? I can. All right, let's let's try and put the mines down. Like, how do we place these? There we go. There's one. Seems you can't activate them from here, which is unfortunate. All right, cool. Let's get behind cover and wait. All right, here they go. Uh, also, let me do this real quick. Thank you. Okay. Smell you later. Wait a few turns. <laughs> Please don't set me on fire. Alright, let's pop a little reload. Let's continue to wait here. This is slightly out of my range. There we go. Well done, Frank. You're very welcome. I would have liked to have gone around and looted a bit more before that mission ended, but you know what? That is absolutely fine. Um, we did extract with three of these rifles, so pretty happy about that. Alright. They want us to go to Rogue City. You suggest dealing with them right here and right now. Let's do it. Rogue City, here we come, baby. So this is where we select our our uh, our operator. We were using Frank, um, who has a uh, extra weapon durability, which is quite nice. As we all know, Victoria is absolute pog because she has extra range. Um, she also has good accuracy compared to the others. I, I I know we always select Victoria, but come on. 
Scouts of Hades, which again uh, makes us a bit more accurate. Gives us a nice uh, a nice perk for doing extra damage, a little bit extra health, and some extra dodge. <clears throat> but of course, before I can do that, yes, 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 yes. Before I can do that, I need to go to Frank and unequip some of the stuff that he has on him. Because I want to take that backpack with me. There we go. Alright, Victoria. Let's get geared up here. Um, take that, take those, put that on. We have we have no helmets. Interesting. Grab this. Grab that. Uh, let's take all of the antibiotics we have, as well as all of the meds. You never know when you might need them. This should hopefully be enough ammo for us. Um. Put that down there. I'm probably going to leave the grenades for now. And with that, I think we're about ready. I'm not going to take a backup because I'm probably going to find a weapon along the way. Hopefully we'll find a bit more food as well. Alright, let's freaking go. Okay, keep in mind we're not getting paid for this. Sad. Very sad. Okay, first we can go to the main elevator. Um, or we can take the stairs through the warehouse level. Alright. We're going to be moving stealthily here. Mostly because I want to conserve our food. doesn't hurt to grab as much water as we can as well. I think that stacks in uh, in fives. Uh, let's head this way. Okay, still nothing here. If I remember rightly, on this level there are um, there are turrets, which we'll need to watch out for. Okay, so we have some kind of activity in this room. Okay. Lovely stuff. Hello. Oh, that's terrifying. Okay. Okay, that's incredible. Put it on. Uh I want to keep this armor. It has really good resistances. Just to hold that for now. Okay. Beautiful. Ho ho ho, MFers. It's me. Not worried about the mine. Bodybuilding increased. God, I'm strong. Okay. Finally. Some good freaking food. Alright, what we got here? We got insulating tape. I don't really... Th this fixes everything, apparently. Okay, I take it back. I'm gonna take that. Has that always done that? Is that a new thing? I'm gonna leave that. <laughs> you know what? On second thoughts, we don't need that.
Kind of gross that you wouldn't flush. Alright, of course we have the repair station. And if I remember rightly, we need to be collecting the wire to make the repair kits. Let's see if that's still the same. No repair kits here now. Different stuff. Interesting. Huh. So can you no longer make the weapon repair kits on the fly? Has that been patched? That's a shame. Take the circuit board. Keep collecting these uh, poppies here so that we can make some morphine. And we have another turret. Okay. Apologies for me um, sneaking everywhere right now, but I'm just a little worried about our food consumption. I don't know about that, buddy. Um, unload. Right, we're getting lots of ammo right now. AK okay, the wire. Um, honestly, I think I'm going to leave this. grabbing those. Aha! Some rations. A Mr. Meaty. We'll eat that right now. Okay, I become stronger and stronger every day. Beautiful stuff. Right, there's a uh, stairs here. What do you have, my friend? You have the uh, the awesome auto shotgun. Um, I guess we'll leave it for now. Let's just try and get this mission complete. Kind of want to see what's in this room. Okay. Probably not worth the ammo use there. That's fine. Let's reload and let's go down to the warehouse. Holy crap. Are you going to give me a flamethrower just like that? Uh, you know I'm taking this. Mostly because I said I was going to do a flamethrower challenge. See if this person approaches the doorway here. Okay. What are you using, my friend? You are using a scorpion submachine gun. Come over here, please. Okay, good, good, good. We need all the food we can get. I think uh, these 9 mil bullets we can forego. We got plenty of those. This is... This looks like quite a nice weapon. Um... But you know what? I think I'm good with what we have in our inventory right now. I often find myself short of armor, so I want to extract with the additional armor that we have. Okay. Come on. 
boom. Man, that's so satisfying. It really is. And some more Moo Moo. Pants. You know we shun pants in this family. Some corky juice. <laughs> I don't know why it's called that. It always makes me laugh. We're going to drop the wire. We're going to take the corky juice with us for now. Never mind. We're going to take the cigarettes. That's way more important. Okay. This is a good weapon, but... With only four shots in it, uh, it's not for me. Not right now. I'd rather get an early extract on the flamethrower. What planet are we on right now, by the way? Are we on, um, are we at Earth? I do know that these are kind of valuable, I think. Okay. This looks like a, a med bay. Another splint thermal container. Um, tempted to drop the splint for the thermal container, but we will uh, we'll hold on to the splints now. Might need them for the future. Okay, we are not hearing anything. Another med bay. A little bit more corky juice. You know I love my corkies. Uh, medical glue. These are good for trading. Fixes everything. Wow, okay. Well, there you go. Let's grab that. I do kind of want the medical glue. If they haven't changed it, we can still craft splints and bandages um, from the ship, so I'm okay to drop those. Alright, bodybuilding has increased. God, we're strong. I'm just kind of nervous about turrets. There's another med bay here. Oh, this is a pretty big map. I don't remember it being this big before. Yeah, um, we can, uh, we can make basically unlimited splints, I believe. What the heck is this? A microchip. Fixes energy weapons. This is a new, uh, a new item. But it reduces the max condition by five. Interesting. Uh, that's not really useful for me, but uh, if we can get away with taking it, I feel like that might make a decent trade good. Ah, oh, you know I love my EMP gun. I really do. No, we have to keep the impact, right? I need them for a very specific purpose. I really do. We can definitely drop the bandages, and then of all of these, uh, I think I'm going to drop the... Maybe the Chick Chick. This I'm... Uh, you know what, I was keeping that for a trades, but I think, honestly, I would like to get out of here with the EMP gun. Wow, this room is full. The Jeff Hammer. Oh, that's another great weapon. Uh, hold on, let me think. Let me cook. Shake. Grenade line. Okay, that's less useful. A devourer. 
Man, the game's really giving me uh, some tough choices right now, huh? I know objectively these pulse rifles are like much better weapons. Oh my god, there's an item chip here as well. We can build a redeemer. Gotta take it. Yes, 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 I know. Um, this is just good because it doesn't use ammo. It doesn't need ammo, you know, which is why I'm, I'm going to take that. I would love to take the Jeff Hammer. But I don't think I am. There's going to be plenty more Jeff Hammers in our future. I say inhaling a heavy dose of copium. So, uh, you know, there's definitely more loot on this floor. But let's not um, let this mission drag on too long. Oh, great. Okay. You've got a pipe. you got a pistol. <sighs> Alright, full auto we go. Beautiful. Keep ourselves topped up. Yeah, part of me kind of thinks maybe we should go back to pick up one of those energy weapons. It did specifically say if you have uh, heavy weaponry. <laughs> Let's hope I don't biff this. Okay, another bit of insulating tape. We may as well use that. There's no reason not to. All right, through the med bay we go. What do we have here? We have glory armor. Uh, it's about on par with this, I think. It does weigh less, though. Resist cut a bit better. Yeah, I'm going to take it. I think it looks cooler, and that's the important thing, right? Some chemtrail... Aha, here we go. Bay 12 vodka. I feel like we should probably take this. If we're if we're planning on um dealing with quasimorphosis later. Alright, please be kind to me, game. Don't give me any BS. Alright, looks like we have a couple heat signatures in here. Ugh, this guy's got a scary weapon. Full auto. We're gonna stay full auto, I think. Um... I do want to take it. Don't worry, I do, I do know that it's valuable. So at least we got the cool ninja armor. Fine, I'll do it. Okay. If I die now, you know, just know that I'm blaming the fact that we're wearing trousers. Sorry, pants. Alright, let's get back to sneak. And let's take a look at this. Alright, what do we smell? Here we go. The service station is this way. It's literally in the next room. I didn't open that door. I did not open that door then. Huh. Weird. Phantom doors. All right. Pull me out. Mission accomplished. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Uh, do I want to now push my luck? 
You know, normally I say yes, I do want to push my luck. But I think in this case, we should be happy that we just, uh, we extracted with flamethrower. That's kind of nice. Okay, they found a PCPU with a database belonging to ANCOM. The agent is ready to meet us in Rebus Sky City. Okay. Let's unload everything there. Um, we've got a few new things there. It's nice having a start where we have decent guns. We have this uh, item chip here for a redeemer. Which we have learnt. And let's put this away. I will need that for later. Love it. We're, we're on Phobos right now. Okay. Interesting. I'm seeing a lot of new items. This is great. Alright, let's take a look at the system map. Okay, so still they haven't added... There's so many things that are going to be added. It's going to be incredible, man. Uh, Fuller. Ah, that is new. That is a new, uh, what is that? A space station? Yeah, an artificial satellite. Love it. All right, well, we need to go to Mars. So let's do that. Bow. Alright, choose Rebus Sky City. It's a peaceful station. Take the PCPU with us. Take Victoria. Uh, you know what, before we do this, let's just check what what's their deal here. They want cigarettes, cola, chocolate, basically any food stuff. Um, and they are owned by Ancom. Okay. Whilst we're here, I don't want to... We need to grab some plastic. Don't let me forget. We need rags and plastic. And rotten meat. And glass. Okay, for the morphine, we need glass. We're going to have to start stockpiling morphine for future missions. This is great. This is telling us a lot of really useful stuff that we need. So glass, plastic, meat, and rags. Okay. Not really anything we can build right now other than bandages. How many? We can build one. I guess it's worth it. Okay. Um, I'm okay with trading some of our water. And... The cigarettes, I know the cigarettes are incredibly valuable, but, um, let's just see if we can unlock anything. There's going to be plenty more water. We're going to stick with Mars for a little bit, so I'm not too worried about Quasimorphosis right off the bat. Alright, uh... Let's go trade this in. Boom. What did we get? Hey, we got a uh, an item chip for impact uh, trousers. Uh, tra we did get a military backpack. Holy cow, we actually got a lot of really good stuff out of this. What the hell? An explosive ammo for a 9mm as well. You know what? That was actually incredible. Thank you. If you need contracts, we will regularly distribute them through SBN channels. Alright, thank you very much, Ancom. Appreciate it. Uh, let's use this right now. Unload. Finish the mission. Seems like you and Frank have satisfied your sense of justice. We're free now. There's chaos all over the system. Taking advantage of the sudden appearance of Quasimorphs, the corporations have reshuffled the market. Stations change owners almost every day. 
Ted's clan, who seems to favour us in its awakening, is squeezing the corporations on Venus. Civil resistance has been showing furious activity on Mars. Maybe we should continue fighting against them if we get paid for it. There's no quasimorphosis there, so it would be easier. We could start working for anyone, and make them the dominant force of the system, or we can try to maintain the status quo for the sake of long-term profiting. It's up to you, boss. Okay, incredible. So we now have the choice of, you know, sticking with a particular uh, company here. Or we can maintain the status quo, which is probably what we're going to do for the, at least the initial period. But honestly, we're going to go after whoever gives us the, uh, the best loot, you know, and we'll go from there. Cool. Well, thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, I just want to say thank you in advance for all of the support that uh, you give me for Quasimorph. If you enjoy Quasimorph content, please let me know down below. Remember to leave a like, it helps me out a ton, and I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.